Hello, I'm Dr. Mark Rojaid. Today we are going to discuss the topic of managing personal stress. Please listen to PowerPoint presentation and I'll come back at the end of presentation to highlight key points of the topic. Managing personal stress. Agenda. Impact of stress on personal and professional life. Major elements of stress. Managing stress. Developing resiliency. Temporary stress reduction techniques. Objective of this chapter is. Gaining knowledge of different factors responsible for causing stress, ways to deal with the stress and remedies to avoid negative impact of stress on health. Impact of stress on personal and professional life. Stress has devastating psychological and physiological impacts on human body. Stress reduces ability to concentrate, causes anxiety and reduces efficiency at work. High stress level in employees can cause increased absenteeism, job dissatisfaction, high accident and turnover rates. It is worthwhile to put efforts in keeping stress levels low for maintaining proper work-life balance and staying healthy. The Role of Management Stress has negative impact on employees and the management as well. Stress reduces effectiveness of the management, such ineffectiveness becomes major reason for increased stress levels in employees. This chapter explains Major types of stressors Primary reactions to stress Reasons for some people experiencing more negative reactions The principles of handling the stress Major elements of stress Driving force is characterized by the stressors which exerts pressure on individual to change the performance physiologically, psychologically and interpersonally. Restraining force is a resiliency developed by the individual to counter stressors. Presence of these two forces in equal amount nullifies the feeling of stress. Absence of restraining force causes stress level to increase drastically, this may result into pathological problems such as heart disease and mental breakdown. The three stages of reactions to stress are Alarm stage Immediate reaction of a human body to threat or major unexpected loss. Individual experiences sudden increase in anxiety, fear, or depression. Emotional balance is restored automatically if the stressor is effective for small duration, otherwise it leads to resistance stage. Resistance stage Body starts applying various defense mechanisms to pacify high stress levels caused due to persistent stressors. These mechanisms are aggression, regression, repression, withdrawal and fixation. Aggression, attack stressor directly to remove frustration. Regression, use behavior that was successful at an earlier time. Repression, deny the existence of stressor. Withdrawal find an escape from stressful situation. Fixation, continue responding in the same way even it is not effective. Exhaustion stage. Defense mechanisms fail to bring high stress levels in control. Leads to pathological consequences due to dominating stressors. Most dangerous phase Coping with stress Three strategies to cope with stress are Inactive strategy Assume an environment in which stressors are eliminated Proactive strategy Improve personal resiliency to deal with stressors effectively Reactive strategy Develop techniques to instantaneously reduce the stress, 
though it is a temporary remedy. Managing stress Following are the sources of stressors. Time stressors This is caused due to the work overload, lack of control, insufficient completion time. Encounter stressors Caused by conflicts between employees, supervisors, or team members causes stress. Situational stressors Adverse working conditions and rapid changes in the work environment can fuel the stress. Anticipating stressors Expecting unpleasant things and fear of failure. Eliminating time stressors through time management. Time stressors Effective and efficient use of time over long run is important to eliminate time stressors. Give priority to the important and not urgent tasks rather than urgent and trivial tasks. Learn to say no. Following are the 20 rules for effective time management, for everyone. Read only important things. Prepare to-do list. Have a place for everything. Prioritize your tasks. Do many unimportant things simultaneously. List 5 10-minute tasks. Divide up large projects. Determine critical 20% of tasks. Save best time for important matters. Limit others' access to you. Don't procrastinate. Keep track of time. Set deadlines. Do something productive while waiting. Do busy work at one set time. Reach closure on one thing per day. Schedule some personal time. Don't worry on continuing basis. Write down long-term goals. Be alert for ways to improve your time management. Following are the 20 rules for effective time management, for managers. Hold routine meetings at end of day. Hold short meetings standing up. Set a time limit. Only important meetings should be conducted. Have agendas, stick to them, and keep track of time. Start meetings on time. Prepare meeting minutes and follow up. Encourage subordinates to suggest solutions to problems. Meet visitors in doorway. Go to subordinates' offices. Don't overschedule your day. Have someone else answer phone and email. Have a place to work uninterrupted. Do something with each piece of paper. Keep workplace clean. Delegate work, identify amount of initiative granted, and give others credit for their success. Eliminating encounter stressors. Collaboration. Building collaborative, healthy relationships and team building reduces interpersonal conflicts which results in stress reduction. Social and emotional intelligence. Capability of managing our relationships with others. Understanding others' emotions and responses. Learning about appropriate social behavior. Ability of solving social difficulties. Eliminating situational stressors. Job redesign considering five aspects to reduce stress. Combined tasks. It gives employee a chance to use multiple skills, avoids stress from monotony and makes employees feel valued. Form identifiable work units. Form teams to perform related tasks. When teams work in coordination and collaboration stress reduces drastically and productivity increases.
Establish customer relationships. Chance to see impact of work done acts as stress buster. Increase decision making authority. Providing decision making authority reduces work stress. Open feedback channels. Timely constructive feedback on performance boosts satisfaction. Eliminating anticipatory stressors. Goal setting. Establishing and concentrating on short term plans and goals reduces fear of unknown. It involves four steps. Step 1 Finding the desired goal or objective. Step 2 Identifying activities required for goal fulfillment. Step 3 Setting responsibility and reporting mechanism. Step 4 Establishing assessment and reward criteria. Small win strategy. Many small changes or accomplishments accumulated together creates big impact. This momentum generates self-confidence to achieve desired goal. Focus on immediate success removes fear of unknown future. Developing resiliency. Some stressors cannot be eliminated. Developing resiliency is a proactive strategy to deal with negative impacts of stressors. Characterized by ability to endure negative stress impact and bounce back from unfavorable situation. Development of resiliency depends on two factors. Personal factors. Positive self-regard and core self-evaluation. Personal coping strategies. Improving relationships, social capital and life balance. Balancing life activities. Resiliency can be achieved by maintaining balance in following life aspects. Intellectual activities, cultural activities, work activities, physical activities, spiritual activities, family activities, social activities. Improve physiological resiliency. Physical conditions contribute greatly in ability to cope with stress. Physical resiliency constitutes of two elements. Cardiovascular conditioning. Dietary control. Improved cardiovascular conditioning can be achieved through regular exercise. Following points should be considered to maintain dietary control. Eat a variety of foods. Maintain optimal weight. Reduce fat intake. Eat more whole foods. Reduce sugar intake. Reduce sodium intake. Avoid alcohol and caffeine. Improve psychological resiliency. Another influential stress reducer. Difference in psychological characteristics are responsible for varying psychological resiliency. Improve hardiness. Take control your life. Consider stress as a challenge. Be committed to work or get involved in work. Improvement in these three aspects reduces stress. Type A Personality Major characteristics are anger, impatience, obsession of competitiveness. A prominent peril for sustainable personal welfare. Small win strategy and the deep relaxation strategy are the remedies for type A personality problem. Social resiliency. Third factor to water down stressors. Immediate and supportive social relationships reinforce the capabilities to overcome stress. Temporary stress reduction techniques. Muscular relaxation. Deep breathing. Imaginary and fantasy. 
Rehearsal Reframing Conclusion High stress levels have negative impact on performance and if not controlled it can lead to psychological and physiological implications. Encounter with stressors cannot be avoided, but individual can cope up with stress by inactive, proactive and reactive strategies. It is important to maintain work-life balance to keep stress levels low. In this chapter we have discussed all the important issues of stress that all of us deal in personal and professional life every day, as we have to balance so many tasks on a daily basis. As life is getting busier for all of us, understanding what causes stress and techniques to overcome stress are crucial for managing daily life. As a matter of fact, stress is a number one cause of many illness. St stress can reduce lifespan and it also can reduce productivity in personal and professional life. Managing stress for managers become even crucial as they are responsible for large number of subordinates. Since each one of us can be stressed by many different factors, we should find our own way to deal with cause of stress. So we need to find what techniques works best for us to deal with increasing stress in our daily life. I hope you have enjoyed the topic today in which the stress, I wish you a stress-free life. Remember, life is too short and nothing in life worth being stressed over it for long.